What up, Ben Ace fans? Welcome to another edition of The Brew Review. I am your host, Ben Ace, and let's hope all this rain. Matter of fact, let's just make it stop. <laughs> right there, you like that, right? Let's get this started. All right, so for today, I actually picked big old Mississippi mud. That's why we're out here, and we're gonna have a plenty good time. Wait, what? We mean to say from Mississippi. It says Mississippi mud on it. it made in New York. Utica, New York. <laughs> All right. Uh, well, that's a good thing to, I guess, learn. Um, Mississippi Mud is not from Mississippi. Um, anybody, all our Mississippi fans out there, I do apologize. Um, but anyways, let's just try this anyway. It's beer. That's what this whole brew review is about. Anyways, uh, if you look at this, it looks really, honestly, this looks like a really good jug. has the alligator on it. What, how else are we going to try it without the trusty mug? <laughs> right here, trusty mug. All right, so um, of course with this, you don't need a bottle opener. It's a nice twist off. And let's just try it right here. Ooh. Ooh, got that black and tan smell. It is but black and tan beer. <laughs> All right, so let's pour this. Always tilt your cup and pour it. Look at that. Since it's a quart, I'm gonna try to fill it up as, most, as much as I can. I still got some more in here. All right, uh, well, I'll just use this for the review and let's just taste it. Okay, first off, before I taste it, I like to you know point out that it has a nice, like, like you said, black and tan color. It smells, it smells really good. Um, let me see if I like it. Not bad, not bad. I mean, Kind of tastes a little watered down. I'm gonna be honest with you. Like it tastes like a nice, um, like a, like kind of like a Guinness style. But if I put water in it, you know, dilute it. <laughs> so with that in mind, with the taste, um, we get one more taste because you know me. I always like to try it twice. Not bad. I mean, like I said, if it didn't have like that water diluted taste. Well, I would have given like a, a little higher rating. Uh, I'm gonna give this, I'm gonna be fair, I'm gonna give this three bottles. You know, it was, it was leading towards a two, but I'm just gonna give it three. Because uh, I honestly, I do like this type of beer. I'm not gonna, you know, don't get me wrong, but like I said, it has like a diluted water taste. It would have, you know, if it would have tasted the way I wanted it to, it would have been higher. Anyways, uh, we put this down. I feel like we're just talking about the taste of this whole video, and we don't wanna do that. <laughs> Uh, the bottle looks really good. I mean, it looks like a big jug. It looks like one of those things where you see, uh, you know, like in Cabin Fever, like the, the very end of the credits, you know, with the natives, you know, like, you know, playing, the guys, like, you know, with the big jugs. Well, I can't, I can't make the sound. <laughs> I tried, I tried, I tried. You gotta, gotta give me an A, you know, A for effort anyways. Anyways, um, no, but Mississippi Mud, big crocodile, big gas jug. It says black and tan, porter and pills of beer. It really puts, it really, you know, already lets you know exactly what you're going for. However, um, it does not mention the alcohol content. But, like I said, that's why this is going to be, it's, it's not going to be a full five. It is not because by it not actually explaining about the alcohol content, it got knocked down. And I'm going to get it four bottles just for that reason. Okay, sorry, that's a penalty. That's the penalty right there. That's what happens. But honestly, I had to look up online. This is a uh, 5.2, I believe, uh, percent alcohol. I could be wrong. Um, I, I only checked out like two websites. Uh, other websites are saying it's five. Other, other websites are saying it's 5.2. So we get to the buzz value. I always say 5% is pretty good. Um, so I'm just gonna give it uh, a three, you know, for buzz value. You know, me, mediocre. Um, I really wish that it would explain about how much alcohol content is in the bottle, but it didn't. And like I said, that's why I got that rating. But hey, yo, know, three, four, three, ain't that bad. You know, ain't that bad for rating. Uh, would I get it again though? Um, for the price I paid for it, I believe in New York, <laughs> where it's from, which is weird because I thought this was out of town. Uh, New York, I was charged four dollars. I remember I saw in Jersey for three fifty. So they charge like a like a like a forty ounce. Um, I think I'll get it again. Um, you know, it had a pretty good taste to it. You know, I mean, from what a watered down pill, uh, porter. Anyways, so um, what do you guys think? Have you guys tried 
Mississippi mud before? If so, let me know down in the comments down below. But anyways, let me just cheers to you guys. I'll leave fill uh, the rest of it up. <clears throat> let me cheers to you guys. Let me fill the rest of this up. We still got more in there. Yeah. <laughs> All right, well, I'm gonna try to chug this whole thing. Uh, but thank you guys so much for checking out the video. Please make sure you check out the channel. I've got plenty of videos, uh, plenty of brew reviews. And until then, for the past and the present and for the future, keep it brutal, guys. Let's see if I can chug this whole thing. Hey, what up guys? Thank you guys so much for checking out the video. If you guys want more, please check out my channel. And also, if you haven't subscribed, click the link down below. That's the subscribe. And if you want to check out more videos, check out these videos right here. But until then, like I say in every single video that I'm featured in, from the past, in the present, and for the future, keep it brutal.